And uh, looks like Quez uh, McNeil. McNeil's going to take the ball end over end at the 15-yard line, go right up the middle, gets across the 20 game. Chris Threadgill, the Chuck. Play there by the 10th grade, the sophomore. A great way to start. That's going to be fun to watch on the kickoff. But, hey, Chris, a long, long football game, but that's a good way to start. Now the extra point field goal team comes out to try the extra point. This has been a bit of a heartburn early in the season as we've only got one game under the belt. Uh, in to try the extra point will be number 36, Trace Beard. Looks like they are running a man off the, the field real quick. As they get set, they shift over from the swinging gate. There's the snap, the hold. The kick is up, and it is through the uprights. And the freshman makes his first field goal of his career, puts the Chargers up 7 to nothing. We'll be back in 30 seconds with a kickoff. You're listening to Chargers. Chargers took the opening kickoff and go out of bounds. at the. We've got a sideline warning against Winona. So 10 from the 50-yard line right up the middle. He'll be hit. And he'll be tackled at the 41. Quarterback power, and he's still on his feet. Short. Coffee's going to take the snap, hand it off to Knuckle, but it was quickly into the second there of rushing on the front right there. The quality might not be as. Waited up is Eldridge. Eldridge line. He should have just let it go into the end zone. And unable to break a tackle was Ashford. The white hat did not. And that Tompkins, I'd lose my mind. But at the same time, Coach Ben Ashley's got to fight the. Uh, with. Since they're going back to talk to the Choctaw County side, I they're get, giving an explanation over to Coach. Just as exciting minute. Maybe the eight. It just depends on the. I don't know if we heard 11 different running. And I think that's the Senzo Miller in the back. A throwing situation might be a little. Uh, he's going to be tackled. That'll be enough for the 22 yard line. Near hash. Going for backs for Carter under center. He's going to hand it off to Rakeem Ashford. Ashford. On the other passing situation. Sort of, yeah, and it was not around and went more outside right there. I know you want to get north and south. Oh, here on WFCA. Take a lot of years. Yeah, if it's. They market and supply coal for you. Uh, Chris White kicks the front of the ball high. Duck is going to hit, take a great field position. Have anywhere. Like you said, nowhere to go. It looked like every hole there was plugged by the hand was senior and. It's caught. Desenzo Miller in the flat. Miller made an outstanding catch. That one in and then got gain more from the end. Looked like it only moved five yards. Yeah. Bring up second down and nine. Looks like the ball is Curry, a junior there for the Just have it. Ball will be capitalized. Getting inside the red zone for the first time. Tigers come out. Two wide receiver field tackled by Andrew Johnson of the Chargers at the end. Gashing run by the Tiger. Field and lose a yard right here on that yard line. Going from left to right. If you're a quick bubble to the near side. One yard line. 139. Uh, 14 to go in the first quarter. And that is they break the huddle. Three wide receiver. Winona returns all that is the one they lost. They had an outs line. Take a Tiger bounce down to inside the th stray horn, but end up he at the passing was only 3 of 10 for 60 yards. You know, Strayhorn's a team good as far as special teams. A minute left here in the first quarter. It can actually be vital to your family's health. Driving to a are ready to serve all of your family. Come back. Winona High School, the Chargers. Have the foot. They try to run the option to the far side, and Winona's doing a good job of playing a side. And um, you won't. Right receiver comes to the near side, one to the far. Thought he had him right there. Maybe just a Thailand couldn't couldn't get on the out. Their athletics. Coleman Funeral Home. Most difficult times. You may. Chargers have to punt the football, so the Tigers will have the football first. Winona will break the huddle. Three wide receivers go to the far side. Wing back to the near. Now they're going to bring one back across. And uh, Olton gets going up the middle. Those numbers. <coughs> Chargers will take that gift to air pass. And it'll bring up fourth down as it early in the season. Not a division game. Sideways and the ball will be down at about the 18 yard here in the second quarter. Chargers will have the football first down and 10 from the eight. Had the turnover. One wide receiver. To, actually, that's number 24, Caleb. Deadly intended for Andrew and in the Charger defense in a bad spot. Yeah, 8.50 remaining here before half. Glenn. Defense is going to have to come up big right there. And this 
across the 35 yard line down to the 32. But it's one of those things is, is 35 pounds, but can go to FCA. Order Tigers lead 12 to swing the hashes and get to about the third. Chargers are going to have the football first down and 10 between back, but um, so you revert. I could have broke that one for a pretty good run. Crease third. Usually, I'm yeah, sorry. Go ahead. Usually see that. 35. So gain of a maybe a busted play there yeah. by the Chargers. Jay Lofton. He's that running back. Take a Tiger bounce, and the Chargers are going to down it at the 40. Pressure there on the inside as far as on Beard when he goes to put up as far as and uh, get a helmet on some of those guys coming up the middle or might see a special team play there by the Tigers. But that's all right. Tigers have the foot across the 40 to the 45. Can't afford clock. It's Dre Metters. It is. He'll come in. In one minute, you're listening to Charger Football. Next step in life. And in business in a great place, and we're ready to take our does. Safety is their top priority. County here in the second quarter. Tackle Israel Whitmore for the big tackle for a loss. That was huge. He's in a junior, and you're a big negative play there on first. He's going to be hit and dropped again for another loss. Charger deal, but Chris, you don't ever take trying to pick that one up. Earlier in the game, he had just sort of fell on it. That okay, Julius Bugs comes in for the those things. Actually, they probably still are the ten down to the six. Uh, Whitmore. Then you had the for the defense. Absolutely, and that'll be. I can't tell what number that is, but yeah, that was Ashford there on the gives him a chance to do first down again. In the four yard line is what I just off the field. That's probably going to, it's going to bring up second down and 12 from our vantage point here in the press box. 115. Feed it to 30. And Caleb Nickel. Now that kind of gives a punch one in here in the first half. In before half. Is on the run over there, and he'll be. And the Chargers are not going to, going to let this clock just roll out. Come to Lindsay's Auto Stickles and Risks. Getting a call and may actually be Renaissance Bank member F the Acro. Insurance in that home you know home stands. Ever wondered what coal production does? Advantage chargers as far as but you, you get through the latter part of this game. Mount just eats up the clock. Uh, we'll have the kickoff and the second half this thing started with the referee and from the 35 on that quarterback read. If he takes a shotgun snap, gonna run the Tigers finds that down on the four yard line and goal from the so I'll bring up third back zone with him for the Chargers. There, he's a 200 moment back in 30 seconds. You're listening and down in nine coming up. You thought it might be that because. The start of Agia. Visit region.com slash next. Today's financial challenge is to help you with our convenient location. And then uh, have the football spotted on the 42 yard line. Things back and get ready for. So stepping it off again, three or four yards. So now they're going to back it up and put it at the 38. Now they're backing it up again? Understand what's going on. Which are still first and 10. Two wide receivers to the near nine before he's brought down. So a good catch by Quest will be on the near hash going from left to right. He'll take the snap, roll to his right. Garrett Abel's number 11, a senior. The Tiger. Rakeem Ashford makes an adjustment and makes the catch at the 20-yard line. And I'll pick him call offensive pass interference. Ouija board and figure it out. Ball, but... That magic eight ball didn't. 30 minutes, it seems like. The Snickers, they're going to bring them out of Snickers. Have you ever wondered what can coal? Red Finance today at 662.15 North in Ackerman. Will you? Welcome back. Not really, sh not really sure what the chain game, which is so 19. 
How is that? I don't know. I think it in 77. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah, that's <laughs> a, the, uh, and I wish I could tell you more. This is where a sideline reporter would come in handy. Hopefully we'll have one before too much longer. What? Second down, and we don't know how far. Now they're moving the chains on that far side back across midfield. It was across midfield, but. Yeah. And forever. Two backs in the backfield. Carter's going to go there at the 18. The first half, because they almost have a return on, he's going to punt the football away. And we'll take that. Uh, into the near, two backs in the backfield. Cooper kind of fake the hand. 20, so another gashing. A lot of clock down an eight. Now they're going to shift everything. Get up, try to bounce to the outside. So three wide receivers go to the far side, one to the near. And the Chargers are going to call a timeout. We'll take that timeout with them. Back in one minute, you're listening to Charger Football here on WFCA. Having trusted medical care close by is more than just convenient. It can actually be vital to your family's health. Driving to a hospital in a or... Today's financial challenge in seconds or loans. Tigers come back out for first and goal. We're back. We're back here in Winona. First down and goal from the five-yard line. Winona has the football on the near hash. 143 to go in the third. They lead 19 to 7. And that's going to put them up. It's back. The kick is up, and it is getting. Tell the other number before he got down. Yeah, just well played. Right. Needing to get something going. And into the bleachers and the rolling outside the tackles. I don't know. Who is right? And he'll have a slice receiver things is called on the Tigers. Yeah, I mean, personal foul goes against the Tigers. It's one of those things that um, back in the day you could have got away. It's fourth down. The down box shows fourth down. Now they get the down marker set right. We've had an issue with the chain game now, I would think, but I don't remember what as far as the – Tight turnover is going to take a sideways charger bounce. Charger defense will have to. Chargers really need to step. Turn. So Winona takes over. Going to hand it off to Cooper. And that will do it for the third quarter. Chargers trail 26-7 to going into the fourth quarter. Chris, we'll be back in one minute. You're listening to Charger football here on WFCA. Professionals at Renaissance Bank is here to help you manage obstacles and risks. Getting across your goal line may call for tools other than checking or savings accounts or loans. Tools such as insurance, investments, or financial planning. Renaissance Bank has the team ready to eat. Means these autos fail, low down payments, and low monthly notes. Kosciuszko and Akron. We're back here at Wine Have the football. Second down and one from the 47-yard line. Cooper takes a snap, looking to his right, going to heave one up. Has his man. He's going to go in and out of the hands of his wide receiver, Ahmad Robinson. Robinson, but it was he dropped that right in a bucket right there. And uh, you'd like to have that one back if you're Robinson because you walk into the end zone. Just, just dropped it. Three wide receivers to the far side, one to the near. They're going to fake the handoff. Actually, going to hit the, hit him in the backfield. He's going to lose about three yards on that third down. Right here, Off to right. They're going to flip Cooper on the other side. Actually, dang. timeout is going to be called at the last second. 
by the Tigers, and we'll take it with them back in one minute. You're listening to Charger Football here on WFCA. Is there a game of us? Ready to take your next step? Visit regions.com slash next step. Well, we're in a great place, and we're ready to take our next step. Regions Bank. Member FDIC. Paid appearance by an actual Regions customer telling his real story. Your friends and neighbors at Red Hills Mine and Ackerman are proud to be a part of North American Coal. Have you ever wondered what coal production does? They market and supply coal for use in power generation, boosting and enhancing the quality of the environment. A message from North American Coal and the Red Hills Mine, proud to be a part of Ackerman and the state of Mississippi. Welcome back. The Winona Tigers are going to punt the football away, and it gets blocked. I think that was Julius Bugs on the block, and the Chargers catch the ball. That was to Tobias Merritt. Makes uh, wasn't that him that made the catch and returned it? And then a personal foul face mask will go against the Tigers. So a big break for the Chargers as they'll have the football in very good field position. He was tackled on the 33, but that'll give him, I think they add 15 from the end of the run. Yeah, it just it. depends on what the Magic 8 ball says on the spot. <laughs> so add 15, and that's going to get them inside the red zone. So Chargers are going to drop back, throw one up for the end zone. And the wide receiver zigged, and Tylen thought he was going to zag and uh, throws it away. So second down and 10 coming up from the 17 for the Chargers, 10-54. Some miscommunication right there. Ball intended for Rakeem Ashford. Ashford ran a hitch route. Tylen thought he was running a, a, a fade. Two wide receivers go to the far side. Two backs in the backfield split behind Tylen Carter. Carter's going to take a snap, roll to his right, and throw one over in the flats. Pass intended for Quez McNeil. Falls incomplete. Going to bring up third. It was just tried to turn around and make it. Eye back, eye, eye formation for the Chargers. Carter goes under center. Is going to drop back. Going to throw the screen there. Tickens that I thought he was going to be able to break attack. Fourth and two from the 10. Fields. Carter's going to take the snap. Flag on the play. Flag on the play. What's going to be the call? That's frustrating. Start on the offense. You don't have to know the down. snap count if you're the wide receiver. You're looking at the ball. So fourth and seven. Ball will be on the 15. Obviously four down territory. You score, you know, if you can score right here, Chris, and kick an onside kick, you're, I mean, you're 10 minutes to go in the ball game. I mean, you you still got a shot. Two wide receivers, actually two backs in the backfield, wide receiver to the far side. Carter's going to take the snap, throws the out route. Falls incomplete. incomplete. So, 10 minutes to go in the ball game. 26 up and eight. So, gain two. Two wide receivers go to the far side. Now they're going to add another one over there, put him on the wing, and put Lofton in the backfield with Cooper. Cooper in the shotgun is going to take the snap. Fake the handoff, roll back to his right. He'll be hit by a host of Chargers. And Darius Coffee on the keeper. And Coffee and third down. has nowhere to go. So third down and eight coming up. So third and eight for the Tigers. With 8.57 to One to the near. Ball on the near hash. Going to hand the football off. That's going to be Lofton. Lofton gashes him up the middle, gets across the 30, 35 before he's tackled. Lofton on the carry. Good field position, but um, 
just gashed the center of the deck. Michael still on his feet, gets across midfield. And that's where you got to quit pushing around and just tackle the guy. Those runs. Stout handing it to Cooper. Cooper gets across the 45, down to the 40. That charge side. Two to the far. Cooper takes a snap, rolling to his left. That's enough for the first down. Stands are absolutely full over there. We like to see that. We thank all those listening on the radio as well as those watching at home. We know our stream's been kind of, uh, when you're away from your home stadium, you have to deal with what you Tell what number that was. Number 10, new to 3A, but they're going to quarterback. Coffee just makes it by the Tigers. Sort of see some life out of them. Absolutely. They've, they've been some, some young guys. But we got a bunch of new guys in there. Carter on the carry, brought down by the Tigers. I don't know if one on is brought quarterback. Looks like. Preston Payne at wide receiver. Also, Zay White at wing back. Can't tell which running backs we have in there. Jewel's going to take the snap, hand it off to, I think that was Desenzo Miller. And here comes Wynonna's youngsters as the starters will come out on third down. So third down and eight for the Chargers. JV off game. We want to get out relatively healthy at this point. Jewel's going to take the snap, roll to his right. Four minutes to go in the ball game. Trace offensively, you're yeah. right. So. Okay. <coughs> and the good. And we're just sort of waiting. It seemed like on the. The yard return right there. That's a 38 yard net. And Brian Threadgill comes up from the outside linebacker position to make the tackle for a seven yard loss. There we go. Showed some speed. We're in number 23. The number we were used to seeing last year. Uh, Adam Thread. Uh, Mills, we have a player from Choctaw County on both Millsaps and Bellhaven. Both um, Tanner Thread Gill will oh, be the the, right. the first cousins will be squaring off. That's the backyard Garber, ball. I isn't think it? so. Yeah. yeah. So for this, or just right. I'm gonna be in Choctaw County. So if you need to go to that one, we we uh, understand. Uh, but I know you're gonna you might have a split crew. You might have to go. One have to go to the backyard bowl. So I, end up, I was expecting you to be gone uh, next week, but uh, we're well, going to be at home, and so that's a great thing as far as the Chargers going to look to rebound after tonight. Yeah, it, it's one of those things. I, I thought I would get out there. so. <laughs> and he's uh, had plenty of action here tonight for the Chargers. On uh, The special teams has been, I guess, one of the bright spots as far as you would say, as far as we've had. We've one of one of point after attempts. We've uh, had a kick. Yeah, so. he, he has done only two. He had two punts in the first half that just were not good, 22 and a 25 uh, that he that he just did not hit. But the others, a 41, a 45, 37, 40, and a 40. It's going to hit at the 40 and take a tiger bounce at the 35, inside the 35, down to the 32. So the Chargers offense will come back out. The games go final. To over the state of Mississippi. Going on, those just come to mind on the carry. Keeps the clock going. Well, it looks like they stopped the clock. Ball, ball will be on the 49 yard line. Off again to Woods. Woods going to go north and south. Gets across the midfield to the 44. Back up. Going to bring up second down and one for the Chargers. 20 seconds to go in the ball game. Jewel gets under center. Hand it off to Woods. Woods cutting it back at the 40, still on left on the clock. The yeah, picked up a first down for the Chargers. So that, moved, that, yeah. that stopped the clock. And that's going to do it. The Winona Tigers.